chapter on what has been related about the parable of the believer who recites the Quran and the one who does not recite. Abu Musa al-Ash'ari narrated that the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him narrated the parable of the believer who recites the Quran is that of a citron. Its fragrance is nice and its taste is nice. The parable of the believer who does not recite the Quran is that of a date. It has no smell but its taste is sweet. The parable of the hypocrite who recites the Quran is that of basil. Its fragrance is nice, but its taste is bitter. The parable of the hypocrite who does not recite the Quran is that of the colocynth. Its smell is bitter, and its taste is bitter. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments Iman, faith, is such a quality due to which the inner beings of humans become fragrant and enlightened. When a believer recites the Qur'an and acts upon it, his appearance is also enlightened and fragrant, and it creates the atmosphere of light upon light. He is useful for himself as well as for others. He is important to Allah as well as among the people. He is like a palatable and sweet-smelling fruit. Abu Huraira narrated that the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, The parable of the believer is like the plant. The wind does not stop causing it to sway, and the believer does not stop suffering trials. The parable of the hypocrite is that of a cedar tree. It does not give in until it is cut down. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments A true believer always faces problems, difficulties, and calamities for practicing his religion. He gives up lots of benefits just for the sake of the religion and bears losses because he abides by religious law and order. But a hypocrite does not consider himself loyal to the practice of religious law and order. Therefore, he keeps securing his personal benefits and avoids the losses. Sins of a Muslim are erased due to the worldly problems and difficulties, while sins of a hypocrite keep increasing and he faces death along with the sins. Ibn Umar narrated that the Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, Indeed, there is a tree that does not shed its foliage, and it is similar to the believer. Can any of you tell me what it is? Abdullah said, The people started thinking about the trees of the desert, and it occurred to me that it may be the date palm. Then the Prophet, peace be upon him, said, It is the date palm. But I was shy, meaning to say anything. Abdullah said, So I informed Umar about what I had thought of, and he said, If you had said it, that would be more beloved to me than this or that. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments This hadith tells that sometimes older people cannot remember something, but the mind of a younger person recalls it. So if a younger person knows something, he should not hesitate to say it out of shyness and hesitation.